Alright, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Uh, last time we helped an old guardian woman find her son, or at least what was left of him. And today I thought, well, why don't we uh, do what we are supposed to do as witchers, and that is actually do some contracts. So, let's go do the Jenny of the Woods, shall we? Whatever the hell that means. First things first, where are we actually heading? Uh, that's odd. Crow's Perch still has a note as board available. Oh, well. Wait, where the... Wait, where the bloody hell is... Je ah, yes. Midcops. Alderman and Midcops. Okay. Well, Midcops it is then. I have toned the graphics down just a little bit. Hopefully it will not be as laggy in the recording. Because... I mean, it still looks good, though. I put everything on medium because I had a few things set on high, and now I put absolutely everything on medium. Where the hell is the nearest signpost? I just passed it, haven't I? Ah, oh, great. I... Great one, Geralt. Great one. Alright then. So, make cops it is. Hey, cops. Eavesdropping on conversations can sometimes provide information about new quests. Oh, that's neat. Not. All oh, right. So basically, I think what they mean is just walking past and just. Damn, I don't know. <laughs> I lost my train of thought there for a while. Right then, we are in Midcops. Took a while to load. Man, I really do need a better computer for this, for whatever reason. This thing is just not performing. It's not like not even near as good as it should, or as it used to at some point, which is weird, but oh well. Alderman. Hide, good folk! Hide! Why would you why? Greetings. What do ye want? So the notice about Jenny of the Woods, you posted it, right? Oh, why? Twas me. You do it. You's a witcher, is you not? Straight off, a picture in me granny's book. Monstrum, or a portrayal of witchers. Remember, like it were today, we be afeard of her. But Jenny of the Woods, what's she to you? Mm. Let's talk rewards. Hmm. Oh, yeah. So, how much would ye wish? Well, then, yeah, 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 I know how this works. Ooh. Let's raise this, raise this up to 300. Oh, no, you don't. That's far too dear. No, oh, have it your way. All right. I'm on it. Know if anyone's seen Jenny of the Woods? Can tell me more about her. Old Willem must have, but he won't tell you naught. He were weak of heart. We found him in the fields this morning. Poor bloke. Other folk are afeard to go out nights. But you might try Agneta, lives at the end of the village. Word is she saw the wraith. Oh. And nothing happened to her? She wasn't hurt? Agneta? Outlived three husbands, that one. <laughs> Jenny of the Woods won't do naught to that wench. Hide, good folk, hide! Wait, what the hell is Jenny of the Woods then? Because now I'm interested. Beast, Jerry, um... I take it she's a wraith. Probably a night wraith. Alright. Hey, Agnetta. Mind a word with the Witcher. Wraith that haunts the village. 
Heard you can tell me about it. Oh, I, I saw her. Saw Jenny of the woods with my own eyes. Like I sees you now, Witcher. What did she look like? In detail, please try. Truth be told, I didn't see her too clearly. It, it were growing dim, see? And this pale shape loomed afore me, mist-like. I comes closer, and the cloud thickened, and something like a visage came out of the mist. What did you do? What do you think, me love? That I'd wait to see the wraith in full glory? Ran to the village to tell folk what I'd seen. I see. So she appeared to you just after twilight? Important clue, thanks. You take care now. Yeah, I think we're dealing with a night wraith. I ran into one of those you know, on one of the islands. It was way more powerful than I was at the time. So I decided to not to try to attack it because... Well, actually, no, I did try to fight it. And uh, I uh, barely escaped with my life. So, um... It was not the greatest thing I've ever done. Let's save really quickly. Alright, let's see. Uh, what are we looking for? Hello? A woman came through here. Barefoot. Oh. Okay. What's this? A piece of fabric. Possibly from a dress. Got snagged on the undergrowth. Stride indicates she was running. Probably why she tore her dress. Somebody chase her? Interest. Whoa, okay. Yeah, I've already seen these. Oh, wait, I'm just heading towards the. the. What the hell am I hearing? I'm hearing a lot of things. Those sound like wolves. Oh boy. Couldn't outrun her pursuer. He stabbed her or slit her throat. Strange. Left the knife behind. Dried blood on it. Could come in handy. Drag the body through here. Clear trail. Doesn't look like we're dealing with a wraith. Seems like it's just a mad madman on the loose lugged the body all the way to the woods buried it here shallow grave murderer must have been pressed for time something sticking out a letter okay now this is interesting because all right great uh inventory um letter found in the grave even though i told him i i don't want to know him. I know you're not afraid of Bokai, but I am. He says he loves me, but it's the kind of love I have with you. It's fierce, frightening kind. Bokai won't leave us alone ever. We have to run, Lee. Oh boy. It's no Wraith, it's just a jealous lover. Hmm. Or at least it's... The scorned lover killed the woman, seems to me. A night Wraith. Alderman probably knew the girl. I gotta ask him. Oh, so the night wraith is of the, the is the wraith of the woman that was murdered. Oh, damn. Well, I better get Spectre well prepared because uh, night wraiths be tough. Ah. Excuse me, lady. Important business. Witcher coming through. Greetings. What do ye want? Zula and Bakai. Did you know them? They must have lived in this village. Good God, he knows? Tis witchery. They disappeared, both of them, into thin air. We've not seen them a week now. I found the girl's grave and a letter. It's clear she rejected Bakai because she loved another. Zula and Ontan, aye. We thought they'd fled north to seek happiness there. Bokai departed round the same time. So that's to mean our Zula's the Wraith. Can't be. Such a good lass. And so pretty. Any idea where they used to meet? Mm, well, can't say for sure. But the young'uns, they go to the clearing, mostly west of the village, past the fields. Zula. Good gods. Good folk, hide! 
Yeah. No way I can hope to lift this curse. Gotta drive the wraith away. Stand a chance if I can bind it to one spot for a while. Okay, so... Hmm. How... Okay, how do the nitrates work? I remember once I read a book, but that was in the previous... Um... There we go, nitrates. Nitrates exudes immense sadness, this helps wrath. I fear them, same as anyone, but most of all I feel sorry for them. Compared to other creatures of the night, Katakans, Negro, Werewolves for example, Nitrates and their rare cousin Duskrates, oh my god, might not seem all that dangerous. After all, one might ask how much harm could a pale withered woman in tattered dress do? The answer quite a bit. Instead of finding this out the hard way, avoid crossing fields and meadows at night at all costs. They are weak to the Irden sign, the Spectre Oil and the Moon Dust. I believe I have all three of those things. Alright. And was to meditate. Okay, good, it's midnight. Although it's friggin' bright as day. Video game logic. Roach, get over here, we got a wraith to kill. Or, well, can't really kill a wraith, you can just drive it away. Banish it back to wherever the hell they go. 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 Alright. Alright, before we do this, I am going to equip some important gear. Did I not have spectral? Okay, moon dust, very important. Cat, not so much. Beast oil, cursed oil, necrophage oil, vampire oil. Ogroid oil, I have no idea what ogroids are. Dragon's Dream, Wolven Honor. Lowers the required level of all items by two. Oh, neat. Vitality regeneration. Oh, neat. But I will need Tony Owl. There we go. Blunt crossbow balls. Do I have any other type? Pretty sure I had... Razor. Well, let's see if I can try to make anything. No, nothing at all. All right, well. Okay, wait a minute. Let's tab. Dancing Star and Moon Dust. Okay. All right, here then. Oh boy. You're uglier than the devil by the well. Come on. Alright, so these two things, Moon Dust. Oh boy, oh no, she's doing this thing again. No, you're not gonna regenerate health. That's right. Now have your long-awaited and long-deserved rest. Whew. Wait, what the hell kind of mutagen is this? Forgotten Vran Sword? Really? 
Wait, freaking really forgotten bloody Vran sword? One of the best weapons in Witcher 2? I gotta get this one. Oh, and it looks fancy as hell. Oh my god, this is gorgeous. I'm happy. I'm happy with this outcome. Alright then. I got a little bit hurt, but not too badly. Alright, well, that was the Night Wraith. That was the Jenny of the Woods. Run, Roach. Need to earn me some money. Best way to do that? Well, do what I actually do for a living, normally. Alright, now this smith, I don't believe the guy over here is actually a uh, swordsmith. I do believe he was an armor smith. Alright, did I? It said I could fix my swords this way. It lied to me, bloody game. Wait a minute. Maybe I can fix it here. Your items have been enhanced. Nope. Oh, well then. Wait, come on. Oh yeah, by the way. Mutagen, right. What kind of... Wraith mutagen... Plus 50 vitality, plus 50 vitality. Well, I got the greater sign intensity mutagen, but nothing more, really. How many points do I have to spend? None, eh? Yeah. Wait, I can? Since when? Okay, yeah. Well, now I do, apparently. Uh, damage of ink also permanently. Maximum of the effect scales with the sign intensity of uh, stamina regeneration combat plus one. Oh, always good. All right, Alderman. Greetings. What do ye want? Got rid of Jenny of the Woods. Jenny of the Woods is gone. Got rid of her. She'll not be back. No, I know how to dispatch night wraiths for good. Aye, of course. Your reward as agreed. Many thanks to ye, Master Witcher. Always happy to help. Farewell. All right then, nice. Did we level up? No, we didn't. At least I doubt we did. All right, what's next on the? Yeah, 240 as agreed. Nice. What's next on the Witcher contracts? Shrieker. What is a Shrieker? First of all, where do I have to go for the Shrieker? I do believe it was in Crow's Perch. Yes, it was. Alright then, well, off we go to Crow's Perch then. Although, I am tempted to meditate just a little bit so that I can wait for the Smith. You Come ain't on. safe unless you got a Gabrielle, the auto crack. Yeah. Gabrielle is the crossbow. I believe I have one of them, actually. Show me what you got. Let me have a look at your stock. Actually, I'm not interested in that. No, not other. No, 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 no. Please. Are you sure you want to repair this item? Yes, please. Ultimatum Forgotten Vransor, that would be great. Griffin Armor, are you sure you want to repair this item? Why has it got a cross on it? Our required level 11. Uh, remove upgrade. 
Dismantle? No, I don't want to dismantle anything. Not at the moment. Look at how much crap I sold to this guy. Uh, but I think that's about all I can sell to him. Okay, well, thank you. So long. Why so annoyed? He actually helped you out big time, Geralt. Seriously, a little gratitude. Also, it's pouring. Ow! Like crazily. Alright. See, off to Crow's Perch we go. Wait, why? Why is the place on fire? Whoa, 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 what the hell happened here? What the hell happened here? Oh boy. I got involved in something, didn't I? Oh, it was probably the botchling. If that's at all possible. And, I, and of course nothing's bloody loaded while I was... Contract the Beast of Honorton. Sure. What the hell happened here? Ugh. Oswin! Where's Oswin? Anyone seen him? I believe I saw him heading to the stable. What? Fire. You blind? Nobody willing to put it out? Ain't that simple. Most are afraid. Baron flies into a rage. He takes no prisoners. My brother's in the stable! We've got to save him! He'll burn alive! Him and the horses! See what I can do. Hurry now! Quick! Oh dear god. What the hell are you doing, Baron? You! You! Where do I know you from, eh? Right, the Witcher! Come, drink with me! Pale as a ghost you are. I know your wife miscarried. Was that before or after you beat her to a pulp? What the fuck are you suggesting? Don't play me for a fool. You'd been beating them for years. Finally, they'd had enough and fled. Sound about right? They ran from you, didn't they? Lying trick! Look, hey, the right roll that is. Uh. Damn it! Whoa! Oh, he actually beat me. Is that the game over then? Apparently, they ran from you, didn't they? Lying trick! All right. There we go. <laughs> we need to talk. Damn straight we do. Ah oh, crap, I didn't save the guy's brother. That's not good. Sit down. You beat them. I never laid a finger on Tamara. Not once. Ah, but this on Anna. That's another story. She always knew how to spark my ire. Your wife. 
How'd she make you angry? Too much salt in the soup? Socks never darned? Twenty years we've known each other. She's seen me drunk and sober. She was there to greet me when I returned the victor. She was there to patch me up in defeat. Like no other, she knew where to press, where to pinch, so it would hurt. You beat her? For that? For criticizing you? Ah, oh, Witcher, you haven't a clue, have you? Well, perhaps I shall tell you about it one day. One day, but not today. Expect me to believe you are a loving father to Tamara after that scene in the courtyard? You're free to believe whatever you wish, but she was always the apple of my eye. She had the run of the place, ask anyone. She'd ride the horses, hunt with the men, at times join them on their rounds. And they'd send for her when I flew into a rage, for only she could calm me. Make it sound like she led a charmed life. If that's the case, why'd she run? I'd hardly need you if I knew. You knew they'd run away from the start? Yes, I knew. Why didn't you tell me? Wasted my time. Say I had. Say I'd said I had troubles. Couldn't control my wife, my daughter. What kind of flaccid prick would you take me for? I wouldn't give a damn. Gotta admit, I do think you're a prick. Not because you couldn't control them, but because you drove them away. What? Don't play the idiot. You gave them no choice. Anna and I. It wasn't as it seemed. Seems. All right, I'm all ears. Tell me what happened. The truth this time. I'd been soaking myself three days straight. Anna came to me, said they were leaving. I begged them to stay. She refused to hear it. I tried to stop her. She wriggled like an eel. We struggled. She fell. Last blasted thing I remember. Woke up in the morn, breeches heavy with my own piss. A large bump on my head. Sadly, they were gone. Know what that's like, Witcher? No. How the fuck could you? I was left with nothing. Nothing! Only the bottle. Signs of a fight in the room. Hole in the wall, wine all over the landing. Was that you? I. We tussled. She tried to whack me on the noggin with a candlestick, but kept missing. Hit the wall and the pillar instead. I staggered backwards onto the table, spilled the wine, slipped and tumbled. Anna used that moment to flee. She rushed down the stairs, still clutching that damn candlestick. I caught her on the landing. We fell. I, I thought I had her. Then she turned and smacked me in the head. I blacked out. Don't know what happened next. When I came to, I was alone. Tomorrow present for all this, she see you quarrel? Through the doorway, perhaps. She didn't enter the room. Shame, too. Things might have turned out differently. The sight of her always calmed me. What happened next? Next? It only got worse. I awoke at sunset, not knowing how many days had passed. Thought it was all a plowing, drunken nightmare. And then I went to the bedchamber, and Anna was not there. Instead, there was blood everywhere. I knew she'd miscarried. My breath short, my throat locked. I neared the bed and saw it. It lay there, a tiny thing, defenseless. On bloodied sheets. Dead. And it was my doing.
Maybe you're doing, maybe not. But that amulet she wore could be important. Or maybe the fact that she lost it. What did you do with the child? What was I to do? Took it out and buried it. Just like that? Damn you! I gave no thought to a funeral. It was a horror. I wanted it to end. That what? child had been my dream. I told Anna, the little one, our little one, to make things right. Yet she died before she could be born. Understand, Witcher. My child was dead. Get hold of yourself. Men like you, when they break down, look downright pathetic. You're a heartless bastard. Damn straight I am. Mutations worked then. But here's the good news. Your dead child might help us find the one who's still alive. And your wife. What? How? Sometimes miscarried fetuses, if they don't get a proper burial, turn into botchlings. Into... fucking what? A cursed creature that draws strength from killing pregnant women. Once it's strong enough, it attacks those who scorned it. But how... how does it know? Blood ties. They're a strong bond. A bond I want to use to find your family. How? One of two ways. Legends claim you can bury a botchling under the family's threshold, perform a ritual, and turn it into a lubberkin. That's a sort of, uh, hob. A guardian spirit that could lead me to your family. And the other way? We kill it and draw some blood. Take that to the Peller and he does the rest. Do not kill my child. It's suffered enough already. Lift the curse that it may finally rest in peace. Where'd you bury the Whatever damn thing? Whatever we do, we gotta find the botchling first. I'll show you where I buried her, and I'll dig the grave at my threshold. If it turns out we can't transform the botchling into a lubberkin, they can bury us in it. Handy either way. <laughs> Oh dear. Well, um, let's get to it and end the episode here. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight at midnight. Then wait here with me. Near midnight, I'll take you to where I buried her. Get word to the common folk. Ought to stay in their homes tonight and draw a line of salt outside their doors. And try to sober up. Do I take a shovel to dig up the grave? Take it. You'll need it, but not for that. Oh boy. Oh man, this is harsh. Oh well. I guess it's gonna take a bit longer than j A bit further. Follow me. Alright then. Well, I guess this concludes this episode. Holy shit, this suddenly got dark and all I wanted to do was just hunt a few monsters and get some proper equipment. Oh well, I guess we can't always get what we want. Um, this concludes our episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have enjoyed this, please like, share and favorite and subscribe to the new guys 23 for more Witcher 3. I'm Oleg and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye!